Where the fuck is Marshall? Hey. Sorry to keep you ladies waiting. Robert Marshall. Johnny Boy and I work together at the company. Excuse me. You know, I gave you a shot to sit in the back seat and you didn't take it. Boom. Ungrateful fuck. Uh, Sorry about that. Marshall here is one of New Bordeaux's finest bounty hunters. Is that a cattle prod? Works every time. Although it does create a hell of a mess when my skips shit themselves. I'll well, keep that in mind. So what did you learn about Aldridge? Little Birdie told me he's been sniffing around our favorite Cuban bartender, Horatio Balmana. Balmana? Are you sure? Afraid so. If Aldridge is such a big deal, why is he exposing himself over a bartender? Therein lies the question, my dark-skinned compadre. Let's go.
sure about Marshall? Man seems kind of tilted. Nope. Now he's good. Upstairs. Be some answers there. Or back. Over there. God damn. Meet Horatio Balmana. Yet. Really? What? It's an Upman. Balmano was a pilot in the Cuban Revolutionary Armed Forces. Back in November 62, the Navy found him and a couple of his pals floating in the Gulf, and they brought him in. Which is where you come in, I suppose. I was already in Nam, but I heard about it. Balmano spilled everything he knew about Castro. We planted a news story about the crew being found dead. And that poor bastard ended up here, tending bar. The way this hand's cut up, Aldridge knows what he's doing. He was trying to get Balmana to talk. You all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah! I got him. Oh. Try not to kill this one, Lincoln. Don't kill me. Why the fuck you running? Have you seen you? Fair point. <laughs> Come on. I got someone who wants to talk to you. It's damn good bourbon, huh? Oh, is that an upman you're smoking? Goddamn right it is. <laughs> Moving up in the world. <clears throat> uh, who the fuck are you guys? Uh, 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 uh. What's your name? Fernando. La gente me llama. Huh? People call me Chucky. You let people call you Chucky? Now why would you? You know, forget it. There's a dead man upstairs named Balmana. Yes, yeah, so? So the man we're after is the one who shot the living shit out of this place. What's that got to do with me? You're not too bright, are you, Chucky? Oh, fuck! You're the sole survivor of a goddamn massacre. That's what it's got to do with you. So, tell us what you heard. All right, all right. Dummy, the man who came in here he was asking about a how. A how? Uh, what house? I, I don't know. Balmana refused to say anything, and then he started screaming. And then he gave him a name. Pedro. Pedro Pong. Say it again, so I can hear it. Pedro. Pedro Pong. Jesus Christ. And that was oh! it. He, he, he told another man he was with that they need to get the crew to the plane as quickly as possible. That's everything I hear. Oh, my mother. <laughs> mean anything to you. Pedro Pond's a code name for a CIA safe house here in the city. Can you keep our pal here on ice back at your place? Sure thing. All right, let's go check out your new digs, princess. Oh. Two of you find yourselves in need of sniper support. Hit me up on the radio. Adios, Chucky. Oh. Stand up.
need to get to the safe house. The Pedro Pan safe house is located in an old distillery in the southwest corner of the bayou. Right. Let's go.
Is that a mail room back there? Inspection station. We review every piece of mail leaving and entering the country. How else would we keep an eye on all those common sense? Yeah. Oh, Yeah. Where's the fucking safe? There it is. There's no safe. Aldridge! Uh. Welcome to the show, Johnny. Yes. You have one last chance. What's it going to be? Don't tell that cocksucker anything. You gotta stand strong. Oh, it's easy for him to say when he's out there, right? <sighs> show me where the safe is before I blow your fucking head off. All right, all right. All right. All right. Oh, you fucking coward! He's gonna kill you regardless! Out of the way. How's the hand? How's the face? Tell me, who's your colorful friend? I'm the motherfucker who's gonna shove his colorful foot up your ass. Oh, I like him, Johnny. He's a keeper. Just take what you want and go. Jackpot. Fuck! Now what? I'll tell you now what. Come here. What? Oh, just get up. So long, Johnny. You fucking bastard. I'm gonna fucking kill you, Aldridge. Maybe. Maybe not.
fuck! We got company. Damn it! What'd he take? Surveillance photos, satellite imagery, and asset files from anyone who's come into the country from Cuba over the last ten years. Fuck! What the hell's this guy after? You know something. I've had my suspicions ever since Chucky said he overheard Aldrich talking about a plane. Balmana and his crew were piloting a plane out of Havana. But they weren't looking to defect. They were returning something that didn't belong to them. The CIA codenamed the incident Dvachka, which in Russian means little girl or commie princess or some goddamn thing. Anyway, the plane's cargo was part of a Russian R-12 theater ballistic missile. Which part are we talking about? The thermonuclear warhead part. Well, this shit just got a hell of a lot more interesting. A storm took the plane down mid-flight. Balmana and his crew bailed. After 12 months of searching, the CIA considered Dvachka lost at sea. Nothing to be done about it. Unless it wasn't lost at sea. Unless, right, unless it wasn't. If Aldridge gets his hands on this, there's no telling what he'll do. All right. So if Aldridge took the files and surveillance photos to track this thing down, then we need another way to find it. What about Balmana's crew? If we could track down another one of the assholes that was on that flight, they may be able to tell us what we need to know. The mainframe's connected to Connor Aldrich.